So yes, finally, 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 I have to actually start with a beat, kind of dropped a little bit in the beginning. So yeah, we're back with another Joking Battle video. We're going to do the PyCon event here. I already have the dono completely done for this PyCon event and stuff like that. I finished it, Now I was like, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and record this video, because I have it up already. I don't have it up, but I have like everything kind of ready to go anyway, though, so. Uh, yeah, though, oh, we got PyCon's new Doka Fest right here. Um, I, I, okay, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm a little bit distracted today. So yeah, we got a new PyCon Doka Fest. He's a Doka Fest with the Nepo this time around. This came out near December of 2020, so um, it was, it is always the end of the year Doka Fest for JP. For Global, we always get usually around this time or in May, but I feel like Global and JP are going to do something in May anyway, because Goku Day and stuff like that. Um, last year, I know we had the, you know, Goku and Angel Macho Vegeta, which were, we were supposed to get in April anyway, because, in May, because that's where the time slot is for the, for the end of the year Doka Doka Fest. They always push that for, um, they always push that for, um, May. It's always been May for Global. But this year they kind of did around, did it for April Fool's Day, so yeah. And of course, with Pycon, his um, big threat right here to use against him is Jinnipo, of course. So yeah, again, nothing really to kind of talk about for his event and stuff like that. I mean, there it is, but um, still. Uh, so yeah, of course, first phase is going to be Int, second phase will be Tech. I think Angel Goku comes in, or Gogeta, one of the two, um, come in, of course, for an in AGL. And last one, I think, will be Gogeta and Pycon, I believe, so yeah. At least, at least you'll be fighting two enemies at least. So yeah, the only Pycon tail, the only awakens from here. It's weird because Dodo Capest banners, they usually do have like an extra unit or whatever. Because last year it was Grace Sam and two, and Drew Deborah. Which made more sense. I mean, for Pycon, yeah, who were you gonna really put it with? Gohan, maybe? Gohan of Adele, but we already have that as a Fools card, which is from the uh, movie itself. So yeah, for Global, it makes perfect sense because they're going down the movies route anyway. So yeah. I mean, we'll do Jimbo's event, of course, separately for his own video, though, because I always kind of do that. This time I used the Super Saiyan 4 team. I wasn't going to use my transforming team, but I was like, you know what? I use Super Saiyan 4. Um, you know, because uh, I, I didn't get to show the team off that really that much, though, but I might switch to it. So, yeah. Um, I, again, I'll do Jimbo's event probably right after this anyway, though, so, um, yeah. Um, but, yeah, anyways, that was pretty good, though, so far and stuff like that. Again, for right now, for Global, I don't, I say summon right now because, you know, the coin system isn't a thing. Plus, again, like I said, on top of that. Um, just these, like, these bands that, like, they always come out in main, stuff like that. Um, hey, man, I love the SSL art right there. So, yeah. Um, again, this is all it's usually for Global. It's always been the time slot, usually, but again, it's usually May or something else. I love a Vegeta right there, then I put Gogeta over it. Um, right here, so yeah. Um, yeah, I like to show up as many teams as possible for my videos. And I could, like, you know, when I start kind of getting into showcases again and stuff like that, of course, for type of units or whatever, so, um, so anyway, I would probably get showcases and stuff like that in there. Um, but again, still again, I'm getting used to my phone and stuff like that. I'm still not used to it though, because I did get the XR, um, iPhone um, XR. Um, if you guys know, I've been using this the last couple days. It's huge, it's humongous, it's amazing. I love it all. It's powerful, strong, good. But oh my lord, though, this thing is heavy though. So yeah, PyCon awesome. So yeah, PyCon is a Doka Fest. Honestly, I don't mind as a Doka Fest. Um, I, I actually, I didn't care. I really want PyCon to get Doka Fest, because Jennifer already has like three of them. PyCon actually is really good as a Doka Fest, in my opinion, though. Um, so, I would do this. Um, just have to have and stuff like that. So yeah, again, PyCon has a Doka Fest. I don't mind, actually, though. Like, I don't care. I feel like he really deserved it one, but he's good. But I feel like he could have been a little bit at least better. Because he, he does so much already, like the Ghost Usher or his active skill. Um, he's lowering attack and stuff like that already. His partner Super Attack, he does so much already, so... I can kind of agree why that kind of buffed him down just a little bit, but not, not he didn't buff him down, but you know, typical little stuff. But yeah, like I said though, previously though, I feel like he did deserve one, but it came out kind of a weird time near the end of the year, which isn't that bad, but it's also like, he could have gotten one a little bit later, because I feel like the movies are saying, you know, LR Gogeta and Janepo for, you know, um, saying, not saying they, but for like, hey, Indigo Goku and Vegeta, that's nice, that's cool. Um, that's their um, LR art for the physical um, AGL. Okay, no, it's for Angel Goku and Angel Vegeta, dang. Um, so yeah, um, I'll probably put AGL physical attack. No, because Pycon's going to be AGL. Let's give Brawl some look at somewhere around. Yeah, let's just give us a Brawl some look here. Um, yeah, I was supposed to say 4s are going to connect and stuff like that. I was originally going to use my Transforming Hero team, but I was like, you know what? I want to give the team kind of a break, though. Um, because again, I still do love doing these Joker Fest videos. They're always so great and cool to use. Um, do stuff like that again, because there was a time where I actually did these, um, constantly back in the day. Um, when I first start, when I was first starting up my channel for YouTube, um, I did these like way way back in the day. Um, try to think of it. Um, I drank a little bit of a blank though. Um, but yeah, I did these way back in the day and stuff like that. I sometimes I had a layout, sometimes I didn't, just because of space reasons. Because I do all this from my phone, like layouts and stuff like that. Like all that's from my phone specifically. But not the layouts; those are from, like, from the computer. Um, Darius saying does those for free. Um, so yeah, um, and he says, "Oh yeah, you can use them for free." So I just put his thing and um, so using his um. 
layouts and stuff like that. Again, it's a free to use and stuff like that. And let's see the active skills, at least. Um, I would go with Goku's. I don't care. Um, it doesn't really matter because um, I mean, Vegeta can easily finish him off too. Um, but yeah, the Resident Force are actually still really good. I don't care anybody says. They, um, nowadays, they still are still great. Even like the like every anniversary unit has aged really well. Again, of course, the first years got easy A's because otherwise they would have been probably dead right now. But now they got easy A's. They're actually still really good though, of course. Hey, that's kind of weird because all the cards are just um all in there. So yeah, uh, it makes sense because you know hit the Angel Goku in uh, any Angel Goku or Angel Vegeta Angel Vegeta to use in um Pokemon Partner Super Attack. So um to get Gogeta in there. So and I messed up there already. So yeah, um dang, I could have put Gogeta there. Um keep it really good right there. Um, I can't I really freaking out. So yeah, um, like I said though, oh, does he end right here after? He can't stun or seal. So you just have to end it here or something like that? Okay. I guess he'll just super partner super attack you, I believe. After this? Oh, Pycon's just coming in. Alright. Okay, no partner super attack here. But yeah, when we, remember when Pycon first got leaked like, from the VJ and stuff like that? And after that, we were like, okay, we can um, see Pycon, that's cool. We need, um, you know, Dunkin' Fest and stuff like that. But then it's like, oh yeah, Goku and Vegeta were in the background like, a couple, like an hour later. They literally tweeted out, like, oh, Goku and Vegeta are in the background. So, okay. Like, they're just literally there in the background, like, you know, for a partner Super Tech. And we all thought, oh yeah, Pycon that goes into Gogeta, you know, solvable active skill unit and stuff like that. We're still going to honestly see that somewhere, sometime around. So we're definitely going to see that. We'll actually use active skill here for Vegeta. Um... But I guess more benefits here. But yeah, I know when PyCon first came out and stuff like that. Oh, um, okay. I mean, actually do that. Yeah, I saw that. Maybe because I tapped down here. Um, from the bottom of the screen, you can also tap, like, the, go into your target, your opponent. Like, PyCon was the first in the beginning. The Goji was on the second half. But yeah, um, again, um, I remember when we first got, like, this stuff with that. I was like, yo, what the heck, man? Um, so yeah. Um, uh, here we go. I mean, PyCon was first getting leaked this stuff like that. I saw that. I was like, I, it was literally an hour later and I saw it. And I was like... Yo, I had posted my video by then. I was like, yo, come on. I was like, are you serious? Are you, like, serious? I'm so pissed off, too. I was like, well, I'm done. Um, I'm just, okay. I was like, okay, just, okay, I'm done. I'm just, okay. Oh, so nice. Yeah. And Pycon does have a new category called Connected Hope. It was called Connected Hopes Um, on, oh, Dodge. A. Hey, um, yeah, three Dodge, man. Be saving you. Um, but yeah. Python does have a new category called Connected Hope. It was called Connected Hopes on JP. Um, they changed up on goal, but it seemed to, um, they just took out the S and stuff like that. So yeah, that's Python's pretty much Joker Best and stuff like that. Um, I'll probably get it done more off screen, no link levels. Uh, not even on screen. Well, they got like probably Wolf of Toys. Perfect. Because I have them are like, what, like five, fours and stuff like that. I'll probably show it off after this. Um, this one's Super Saiyan 14 though, because they all have as many links and stuff like that. So yeah, that was Python's Joker Best and stuff like that. And of course, I will show off his. Okay. I have to hold up in the middle and see it though. So yeah, again, I'll show off his like his banner and stuff like that because I usually kind of like doing that anyway for the video. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much that. Pike on Doka Fest again. I'll probably do Jinip I'll do Jinip was right after here, but specifically though for this video, I didn't want to focus mainly on Pycon. He is good though, like he does really a lot. But it's his banner right here, of course. I probably do not summon on it though because saving for the anniversary is really priority. Plus right now on JP. They have, a new, they do have a new coin update where basically you use like units for coins. For example, um, if you have Pycon right here, fully rainbow and stuff like that. Even like even back in the hiding, you can also keep the SSR um, if you really wanted to go that far on JP. Now you can keep because we have the same name update where you can use units with the same name. Kind of like how Legends does it. Or basically for the global, which you know before we had like characters like for example, um, this Gogeta right here. Um, specifically, um, he's SSR right here, but you can also use his SSR, um, and of course LR on the same team, but you can use his UR because he has the same name as LR. But now JP, now you can use all the way, you can use all of them, SSR, TR, and LR, and of course, um, JP does have a new coin update, for example, Pycon could be fully rainbow and everything, all new pads unlocked, and you can also sell his SSR or keep it for the same name update, but you can also sell it if you felt like it, like you can just sell the unit, um, with coins, like for example, if you sell him right now, if you sell him with Doka Fest coins and he's on Doka Fest banner, you could do that. You could go for yellow coin units, like only specifically from that banner. So you could pull, um, let's say, for example, um, like if you just pull like any unit with, um, on the Doka Fest banner, they had to be, okay, let me see, go more of an example right here. Um, for example, um, let's use a non unit. Um, yeah, like for example, if you pull like, you know, Vegeta Blue right here, like uh, Vegeta Blue, Super Saiyan 4 Xeno Gogeta, yeah, out of context right there. If you pull him from a, for example, you pull him from the Heroes Banner and stuff like that, you have him fully rainbow, all that, you can't keep it this R, or you can choose to sell it for blue coins, because he's from that, like, he's from banners that are not blue coins, so yeah, he's one of those units, same thing goes for, for Goku, wants to sell SSR and stuff like that, um, you can go right ahead, um, 
for example, right there. Again, you can sell as SSR and stuff like that, or you know, choose a keep it or whatever. Get the same name update. Doesn't matter. Doesn't care how you do it and stuff like that. So that's how it's gonna be structured for JP. Um, again, those coins are absolutely beneficial. And summoning right now really isn't worth it. Even going for Janepa, my even going for Janepa himself, I say don't summon it because again, without those coin, without the coin update, let's go back. Without the coin updates right here, you're just summoning is kind of just pointless and useless because you're just summoning blindly. You're not getting coins for SSR units because a lot of people are gonna have some of these units like Rainbow and stuff like that. But well, the banner actually really isn't that bad. When it came out for JP, I was like, yo, I'm impressed with the banner. It's actually really good. Again, PyCon's good. Um, Gogeta's good. You're good. You're good. Like, they're all good units. Dragon Ball Super Broly. Uh, this Gogeta guy's easy. Yeah, again, the whole banner is really good. It goes to PyCon's category, Connected Hope. But I did not search it up beforehand. It'll probably be somewhere in the middle or somewhere down. Yeah, corrupted, um, no, corroded body and mind. Um, Pleasure Destruction. Connected Hope. It's, it's somewhere around here. I definitely know it. Um, connected hoop. Uh, connected hoop. Can't find out here. Wish we had a category system to search it on. I know I probably passed it. Like, oh, we even passed it already. Um, I will find it on here. I had it on here earlier, right? Uh, connected hoop. They're probably somewhere right now. These are like where all the categories are. Um, I can just. Resurrect the warrior, other warriors. Can, there you are. There you are. Yeah. Um, oh, you know there. So yeah, again, the categories just kind of fluctuate, fluctuate everywhere. So yeah. Um, again, for heroes and stuff like that, it's super simple. I think for no villains on here, I don't believe. You had a couple of little villains, so you're not going to really use those guys that much. But yeah. I mean, overall, the category, it seems pretty okay. Um, again, when they first came out, it was still pretty okay. Of course, you got all Gogias on here. Fear Bomb Goku. Basically, anybody who's, who's considered at their last hope. Tian's on here. Because they save Ultimate Gohan. Miles, everybody's hope. Um, I think Dragon Ball Super Trunks should be on here as well, I believe. So I can actually check on the banner is he on he's all these band no no wrong one is he on the Geneva banner i believe is he he's on connected hope right i think they changed that on jp no he is not really weird because he made the spare bomb connect everybody's hopes and stuff like that and of course the april full background here right here so yeah gonna go any video here and stuff like that so yeah see you guys later though thanks for watching have a great day great life all cool joke again though make sure you stay safe wash your hands god bless all you if you're going out putting wearing a mask do some toilet paper if you need to but so what do you guys think about the PyCon Doga Fest? Do you like it? Do you hate it? Um, and stuff like that. I say do something on the banner, your coins, your stones, and stuff like that. I mean, I say do discounts, but after that, don't do it. Save for the anniversary at this point. Saving for the anniversary really is more important and stuff like that, though, of course. So, um, okay, my music kind of, okay. Oh yeah, I wasn't the last year, my music kind of messed up there. So yeah, sorry about that. Um, but yeah, is that really worth it right now to summon and stuff like that? Gonna save for Janepa as well. Blah, 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 blah. Don't summon, save your stones for anniversary, coins, tickets, discounts. Whatever! See ya. See you guys later though again though. It's out.